a blessed day and welcome this morning we will be meditating on the book of proverbs chapter 16 and verse 32 better to be patient than a warrior and better to have self control than to capture a city this morning we see that the ability to defeat others in battle is impressive but well developed self control is an even rarer gift a person who can control his emotions is better than someone who wins wars the truth is that one must be able to be internally patient before ruling anything external in the book the three edwards thomas constain described the life of renald iii a 14th century duke in what is now belgium grossly overweight renald was commonly called by his latin nickname crassus which means fat after a violent quarrel renald's younger brother edward led a successful revolt against him Edward captured Renald but did not kill him instead he built a room around Renald in Newkirk castle and promised him he could regain his title and property as soon as he was able to leave the room this would not have been a difficult task for most people since the room had several windows and a door of near normal size none locked or barred the problem was renault's size to regain his freedom he needed to lose weight but edward knew his older brother and each day he sent a variety of delicious food instead of dieting his way out of prison renault grew fatter when duke edward was accused of cruelty he had a ready answer my brother is not a prisoner he may leave when he wills so renault stayed in the room for 10 years and wasn't released until after edward died in battle but then his health was so ruined he died within a year a person who has no self control is a prisoner of his own appetite If you want to develop the fruit of self-control you have to honestly answer these questions What am I a slave to food lust power money the past drugs alcohol bitterness jealousy anger fill in the blanks What do I have to say no to right now What do I have to say yes to right now? Where or how do I better incorporate the fruit into my life? Once these questions have been honestly answered, we can return to the Lord for help, who is willing to lend a hand to those who are in desperate need of change. Let us pray. Dear Lord, help me to be self-controlled and never give pressures of this world the opportunity to get the better of me in jesus name i pray amen shalom maranatha